It's just one of those things that it was just like sticking out the bag and I was like, oh my god, I need to know what this is. <laughs> I've literally been sat here for probably about a few minutes now just thinking how to like start this video and I'm just like yeah I got nothing. Hey everyone and welcome to Kimmy's show and so once a week I do Disney themed videos. So my last one I did was actually my tools for a pound so if you've not seen that please go check that out and today is my Tokyo Kawaii subscription. So I've actually had this for probably about three weeks now because if you didn't know recently I've actually changed my channel where instead of doing two videos a week I now do one so there's a lot of things because we know I actually keep a lot of things underneath my desk so just waiting to be filmed and I thought right I really want to do this I've had this for about three weeks now I just want to open it and see so yeah let's just get into this so if you're new to my channel and don't know what the Tokyo Kawaii subscription is, it's basically uh, a subscription that I should get from Tokyo. So the one that I do is a few items are from the Disney store and then a few items from the park. Now you can do it monthly, you can skip, so I actually do mine every two months so you can obviously skip it. It's up to you if you want to do the ones to do with the park as well, because for me personally, I do actually like the idea of getting a few items from, from the park. Obviously, you've got to pay extra for it. I'm just going to open this. Michael, the guy who does it, um, you can actually save a certain characters you want or certain things. So, for example, if you're more into the toys or stationery or sweets, that kind of thing. So, China gets it that more catered to you. So, yes, yeah, so I've just got the bag here. So, I'm just gonna oh, dive in so that is one there I don't know oh there's more stuff <laughs> I'm trying to get it out without seeing because I have no idea what's like in here so it's one of those things that it's kind of fun for me to do but yeah that's completely empty so oh oh Mimi look at that that's cool that's nice. I don't know if I'd want to use it though, because that's actually quite pretty. So the first thing I got is actually this here. So this is actually from the live action Mulan, and I really like that. I really like that style. So obviously this is a bag from the Disney store. Obviously I don't know how much these things cost individually, because obviously I get a subscription, so I just pay a certain amount. So I have no idea like how much these cost individually. At the moment where I live, all my Disney stores are closed. You can obviously get some stuff on their website, but at the same time, I like the Tokyo Koei one, because I kind of feel like you get things there that you don't get in other stores but I actually think that might go straight in the shrine because I think that's really nice so yeah so that is just a tote bag but yeah no I really like that so that's a great start so the next ones I've got are just these here so I'm just going to dive <gasps> Oh my god, that's so pretty! So this is Rapunzel and it looks like it's a little jewellery box so I'm going to have to open this because I don't know if there's anything in there. It might just be an empty jewellery box but that's so pretty. So this does actually say it came from the Disney store so it's one of those things as well like I don't know, for example this, if this has like another character like with it as well whether there's like a few different ones or whether this particular design is only for Rapunzel. So, oh, just gonna take that out. So yeah, so that's what it looks like. I said it's got Rapunzel on there. It's also got a little bit of detail on there. I'm just gonna open it to see. Oh, I think it's stationery. So, oh yeah. <laughs> so you actually get my like, little stationery notes in there, but it also comes with a mirror as well. So it's very similar to one I actually had a while ago. It might have actually been in my last video or the one before where I actually had a aerial one, like a little trinket box that actually came with two drawers and it also has stationery in it because if anyone knows me, I love my stationery so some of that is really cute to have. You could obviously put like little trinkets in there, um, you put like your rings in there, your earrings, that kind of thing. To this day, I still haven't actually used my aerial one for anything. It's actually sat on my vanity because it's so pretty. I've not actually used it for anything. I was like, it's so nice. I don't know what to put in it. But yeah, so like it says, that one actually came from the Disney store but I don't know if that design, for example, if this actually has say, like a jasmine one or a bell one, that kind of thing. But yeah, I really like that. I think that's super cute. And like I said, I love the fact that she comes in stationery as well. So I'm just going to put the stationery back in. Oh, she says. I'm just going to leave it. <laughs> right, I just noticed this sticking out. <laughs> I have no idea what this is. Obviously, it's flounder. But I don't know what it is. I don't know if it's supposed to go like in a drink or something. But that is really cute. Like, I have done a flounder video for you guys 
probably about two years ago. I'm trying to remember when I actually did it because I actually went for a phase of doing sort of more psychic. So I now do like a Miko one as well. But I guess I'm, I'm don't know because oh, I don't really drink. So I'm assuming it's something they put in a drink to obviously like stir it. It's just one of those things that it was just like sticking out the bag. And I was like, oh my God, I need to know what this is. <laughs> right, so... What else? What else? What else? What else? I don't know what I'm picking up. That's the only thing with these. I have no idea. <gasps> oh my god, that is super cute. I don't know if I want to use that because that is so nice. So this, uh, yeah, came from the Disney store. So this looks like it's a rubber, a pen, and something else. I don't know what that is. So it's actually frozen too, but it just shows on the back. So obviously it shows you've got a rubber, you've got a pen. I don't actually know what that is, so I can't really tell, because obviously I can't speak the language, but I can't really tell what that is, so I don't know. Oh, okay. Ah, I think, ah, okay, I've worked it out. So I think this is actually a pencil, and what this is, it's actually got the lead in it, so when you run out of this, I think it's one of those ones that you click, and obviously the pencil comes out, and I think once you've used up the lead in the pencil, that's actually refillable. That is actually really cool, I really like that. Now, as much as I like using my stuff, this is really nice, because I've just recently, uh, about two, three weeks ago, changed around the shrine, and I've actually got a frozen two section, so I don't know where I'm gonna put this in the frozen tube but until I need to use it just because this is really nice I really like the packaging even though know, me and my sack of a packaging like literally anyone that does like really nice packaging that's what I'm gonna buy so for me personally I really like that as it is um, I'm not in a need for any like pens and pencils at the moment so I kind of feel like at the moment this is gonna stay in the shrine but yeah I really like that and I thought it's actually a frozen two one as well because I don't have a lot of frozen two things with both um, Anna and Elsa on together Right, so this is something squishy, something, I don't know what this is. Oh, that's so cute. So I've got this one here, which is like a little like purse of bags. So this is obviously Rapunzel, but you've got a picture on one side and you've also got it on the other side, just a little bit more uh, blown up. So it's obviously her and Pascal. Now, I'm just assuming this is just a normal, yeah, so it's just got, uh, so what I could feel. Oh, so he's actually put inside, um, so he just says, uh, keep staying safe and rad Michael. So he does this every time where he puts like a little note in there, which I think is super cute. So yeah, and it's just got the little phone bit in there. Now I have been known to use stuff like this as an actual purse. I like to keep like your cards in it, like, you know, just things like that, like your money when anyone actually has money. Cause things like this is quite nice just to kind of have. Now at the moment I've got quite a few of these. So I might put this on the shrine because um, I don't like have too many on the go. It's almost one of those things that I use one until it's completely worn out, retire it to the shrine and then I use another one rather than having so many on the go of course I'm just gonna end up losing them or I might accidentally pick it up and it's not actually got the things in it I need so at the moment I feel like this is gonna go in the shrine until I actually want to use it because I did have other ones um, I had an aerial one and it was so pretty it just stayed in the shrine because it was kind of like a nice pastel kind of color so I really like that and I think it's actually a really good size as well like I really like the size of that like the actually thing I've said before sometimes when they do like purses and things like that it's more designed for children and I find sometimes they don't open wide enough or they're not deep enough to actually put adult things in obviously I know my phone's not going to go in that but normally I've got my phone in my hand or in my pocket so I don't really mind right so I think we're near the end now I'm just gonna Ooh, I have no idea what this is but I think I'm gonna have to open it so it's actually this here this looks like it could be like a scarf or some type so I'm just gonna get it out oh that's really pretty actually so it's actually got which I've actually seen um, uh, actual like ornaments and decorations of the shoes done in like a princess style so I kind of feel like this is kind of taken from that where it's obviously all the different princesses shoes but they do actually have them as like ornaments I've never had them myself just because I always find they're a little bit too expensive and to be honest there's probably too many that I'd want that I kind of feel like I don't want to, <laughs> like I don't want to buy one and be like okay I really want another one because I like a different design so kind of for me this is like the best way to do it but yeah so it's kind of I don't know, almost like a scarf. So if you watched my video, I think I did. Oh yeah, it's my Asda one I did. So not the last one, the one before. I actually got from the baby section, like a little scarf thing, like a little show. And what I did is I actually folded it like that and then I kind of put it around my neck and then obviously you can tie it. I do actually have a thing that you can put there. To be honest, something like this, 
I don't know if I'd actually use it as decoration because I do actually have things around the house like this as decoration but I don't know it just seems so nice like I would like to wear it one day but at the same time I'm just like it's just too nice oh my god just looking at the actual shoes <laughs> But yeah, no, so uh, <laughs> that's me getting distracted. So yeah, so that was it for my Tokokawa E subscription. So if you don't want to miss out on my next one, then please like and subscribe and click the bell notification. Obviously get notified when all my videos go up. My next one hopefully will be a high street one. I'm just waiting for a few more items to be sent because we actually had to do it online. So hopefully that'll be my next one. If not, I might have to consult the list because I do actually have a list of things I'm trying to get through. Um, I have to have some people already comment on some of the things they want to see. So if you want to leave a comment on things that you actually want see from the shrine then let me know that's something I can do and I'll do a shout out to you as well but yeah that's it and I'll see you guys next time later days